currently sat in Britannia Mill, which is where we house all of the studios. The studio space is really important. It allows you to engage with the image making in a way that you can take forward into your clinical practice. It's something that is really important as an arts therapist, thinking that you are exploring your own way of making imagery. It means that when you're working with clients, you can help them through that process because you've been through that process yourself. I think it's something that's really, it really helped me to think that I wanted to study at Derby, knowing that the image and the process of making was something that was really focused on, really central. And you can kind of see that now in that we have an exhibition at the end focusing on all of our images and the process of making and really allows us to explicate that process and allow other people to see that. As an arts therapist, the image is of central importance. And I think that needs to not be minimized, which is why it is amazing that we have a show in such a lovely studio space. I think another really important aspect about having an exhibition is the idea of networking. And as fledgling art therapists, having just done a two year course, it's really important that you have the chance to network with established art therapists and that sense of community is really important to build and foster. And I think that having an exhibition is a really good space to nourish that and to bring that into my own network as a new art therapist. I came to art therapy from a fine art background. I remember feeling really lost when I finished my undergrad because I'm an oil painter by background and I just remember thinking, oh, what, am I gonna, what will I do with this? When I found art therapy, it allowed me to see my practice in a different way, in a way that I could help other people. And I came to realise that my own practice was therapeutic for myself before I even understood what art therapy was. So doing this course really allowed me to understand what I was trying to communicate in my work. And I think that process, being able to stay with that for two years, is extremely intense. <laughs> and at points it's really overwhelming, but it's probably been the most fruitful education that I've gone through. And I think that I've learned so much more about myself, my own practice that I can now help other people with. It's felt very enriching. And I would encourage anyone who feels a bit lost in their art practice maybe to think about what their art practice means for them and whether they could use that process to help other people. Something I would say to prospective students is just to think about who will be supporting you throughout the journey and I found the teaching staff here ridiculously supportive. They have, offer lots of clinical experience and just lots of personal support. It feels very person-centered and they've really helped me through my journey.